Hey everybody, before I get this review started, I wanted to mention they made my sandwich wrong. It was supposed to be A1 steak sauce on, but instead they put a little bit of ketchup and a ton of mayonnaise, you'll see in the video. And uh, I'm reviewing it as is, and I'm not going to go back and get this sandwich ever again. So I hope you like this video. See how much mayonnaise they put on this dang thing. Hey my legion, how y'all doing today? I'm here today to review the Steakhouse King, the new Burger King sandwich. Uh, this was $6.29, so it's kind of pricey. And it's similar to the Big King sandwich, you got the two patties, the bacon, you got fried onion in there. The bacon's under all this uh, mayo. They put a ton of mayo on this. Look at all that. Uh, but there's fried onion straws on there too. We'll mass all the mayonnaise and ketchup. So let's go ahead and try this out. I never had their barbecue uh, bacon king. Go ahead, the cheese stuck to the thing, the wrapper. Alright. Hmm. And they're very delicious and very flavorful. I don't think there's much of a distinction between this and the regular uh, Bacon King. It tastes pretty good though, but boy, you can barely taste the fried onion. They put so much mayo on here. They put a lot of mayo on here. And the first time I ever got here with mayo, I know a lot of people complain Burger King puts too much mayo on their sandwiches. It tastes pretty good, but I get no real distinction of why it's a uh, steakhouse king. Like I said, I barely taste the fried onions. And for the price, it's only okay. I give the Burger King's Steakhouse King a uh, 7 out of 10. So until next time, bye, please. Take care of my allegiance. Lots of mayo.